Hi, it's David here at Pelham James, and today I'm with David Taylor, who's uh, chairman of Stamford First, who is responsible for the neighbourhood plan of Stamford. So what is neighbourhood planning, David? So neighbourhood planning gives communities the opportunity to shape the growth of their town uh, going forward. Um, so it can influence uh, where development takes place, it can influence the infrastructure that's built into new developments, the design of new developments, it can protect uh, green space and um, r r really shape uh, the, the development of the town. Um, the whole ethos of neighbourhood planning is that it's consultative, so the plan which we've now written is at draft stage. Um, is the culmination of a work which started with a survey uh, which went out to all 7,000 houses in, in Stamford um, and that gave people the opportunity to, uh, to talk about the Stamford of the future from their point of view and what they'd like to see. Uh, we've also done further consultation and using that consultation and the engagement of the community, we've now uh, taken the, the, the plan to a draft stage. Okay, so, so how will it help the development of the town in the future? Well, um, I'll talk about how it can help and how it can't help, because yeah. both are important. Yeah. The first thing to say, and the most important thing to say is, development is going to happen in yeah. Stamford. Okay and um, the, the numbers of houses are dictated effectively by central government who in this case issue targets to South Castephen District Council yeah. um, so development is going to happen and there's nothing the neighbourhood plan can do to stop that. Yeah. What we can do is as we've done in the plan uh, have an influence on uh, where properties are built, uh, the design of properties um, the infrastructure that, that, that goes in with those developments uh, and also ensure that green spaces in particular are, are protected, that the sort of heritage and the culture and the character of the town are protected as well. Yeah. Uh, and we've also been able to influence the design or the, the layouts of some of the new developments to ensure that they incorporate uh, both green spaces, uh, shops, uh, a new primary school which will be built, yeah. um, and also to uh, and also to ensure that green space is built into new developments as well. Yeah. Uh, so, <clears throat> um, and at the end of the day, the neighbourhood plan is a statutory planning document. So, when either South Castephen District Council or uh, Stamford Town Council, as consultees to uh, to planning decisions come to assess a planning condition uh, or a planning a planning application uh, that will be uh, that will have to comply with the policies that whether in the neighborhood okay. plan so it's got real clout yeah fantastic like you say um, obviously it's a beautiful fantastic town that we all love living in and it has to develop over time and obviously this is an opportunity to help sh shape it isn't it yeah. so, so, so how can the residents of the town get involved in this? Okay, well, <clears throat> many of them have been already. We yeah. had 2,000 responses to the original Fantastic. survey, which was the, the bulk of our evidence and, and, and has shaped the plan to this date. Um, we're now in a consultation phase, mm. so the plan is written, um, and we're encouraging uh, residents to get involved with the consultation. Mm. Um, the uh, plan itself can be seen on our website or downloaded yeah. from our website, which is stamfordfirst.org.uk. Yeah. If people want a hard copy, they can come along to the town hall uh, and pick up a copy here. And we've also we're also holding a number of consultation events around the town where people come along yeah. and be told more about what neighbourhood planning yeah. um, is and 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 uh, about the policies in in the plan. How do they find out when those are taking place? So they're on a website, on yeah. the first page of our website. Yeah. Just look at the events uh, tab, um, and they're being held at various locations around the town so that everyone can can get to them. And then once you've seen the plan, whether you look at it online or whether you look at the hard copy, um, then we have a simple email address, uh, stamfordfirstuk at gmail.com. Yeah. Uh, and uh, feedback your comments via an email or direct to us at some of the events that uh, we'll be in attendance at. Brilliant. Okay. So it really is something that the actual residents can help shape it, the future, which it, is vitally important. Absolutely. Yeah. It, it's, this is all about community engagement. It's all about 
people be able to express their views about what they want to see in the Stanford of the future yeah. and the neighbourhood plan will go a long way to producing what it yeah. is that they want. That's fantastic. Well, thank you very much for that, Dave. That's really, really kind of exciting to hear about as well. So can you just remind us of the website? So, so the website is stamfordfirst.org.uk. Brilliant. Fantastic. Thank you for your time. Thank you.